Hey, how's it going, everybody? So, I found something out, and I thought I would let you guys know about it. Uh, something that I found, which is here at our starter location, where my little house is, and where I'm making my little underground base, is that there is a gold chest really close to here that you can actually access uh, right at the start of the game and it's not far away so if you run over here to the edge of the valley and there is the elixir well that is down there in the shroud and actually you go right there just behind it there is a little cave that runs out the back there and there is a gold chest inside that cave. So if we just glide down here. Now you will have to fight a couple of enemies once you get in here, of course. But, you know, these guys, they're not much of a problem. We can get past most of these guys. So there's the tower. And if you come right over here. There's a hole in the ground right there, which we don't want. The cave we want is actually right here. So just behind the pillars, there are bugs down here. So you're going to have to watch out for them. Do not take the one to the left. Take the one to the right. And this is where we start running into the bugs. <laughs> but they're pretty easy to take care of. And we can get critter parts from them. So... That's always a good thing. Because we can use those later on to make stuff with. But right down here at the end of this cave, we are enshrouded, but we've got enough time. We can go through, search this thing, take that stuff, and there's a gold chest right there. And we have the level 3 Misfortune Mace in there because gold chests uh, level up depending on what area you're in. So we're at the beginning of the map, but still, you get level 3 gear out of this thing. And if you want to go back and just keep farming this thing, you can just go back to the main menu, click play, private, or if you're on a public server, you can go there too, and go back into your world, and you're going to spawn back at your base. I tend to spawn back at this one <laughs> because this is a level three altar that I've got here just over my cave base. And we'll take a little run down the hill here. No uh, wolves around. That's a good thing. Don't want to run into them. Oh, get up there. Come on. Get. Nope. This way. There we go. And we're just going to glide back down there. i got a little bit more height this time, so I might actually clear this big rock right here. And we'll get a little further back there. But I am running out of stamina at the moment because of all that jumping. So we're just going to walk back here because these guys are kind of stupid. And they won't attack me right away. But we'll take a little walk back here. Try not to run into the guys with the arrows over there. Nope. Ah. Stop that. No. You're not allowed to attack me. Go away. <laughs> and we're going to go back into the cave. The bugs, no doubt, yep, have respawned, but, you know. Eh, we'll just take care of this guy. And this guy. There we go. Take all your stuff. You inconvenience me, I take all your stuff. And our gold chest has reset. And we have a level 3 root staff. Nice. And then we can get the shroud liquid and the spores from there again. And just rinse and repeat. Keep coming back. Keep going back to the main menu and coming back here and you can just keep raiding this chest for whatever stuff you want out of it. 
So there you go. That is the closest gold chest that I could find at the moment. So have fun with it. I'll catch you later.